Hey guys, it's Big Josh, and today I'm gonna show you um, a pop haul of all my NYCC pops that I got from the, you know, con. Uh, well, just, you know, all of it. Um, so let's get into that now. Um, all right, so I'm gonna show you all the pops from, you know, New York Comic Con, shared ones, and I got some uh, con ones as well. So let's start off with the ones that I got from the con, or just the ones that the one that I got from the con. So I have the um, silver chrome All Might from Funimations. Um, I kind of like it. I mean, I, li I don't really watch My Hero Academia, but I do like the box. Like the box looks so awesome. Like, you know, and I mean, the silver chrome all might looks cool too, just inside the box, but I like the box and that's pretty much all I, I liked about it, really. Um, next I'm going to go to the ones I got from Hot Topic. So from My Hero Academia again, I got the Dobby. I mean, this one, like I said, I don't really watch My Hero, but the Dobby looks so cool, like the little like chin thingy that he got going on his mouth or whatever looks pretty cool um the little like fire or electricity coming from him from the bottom looks pretty cool and uh yeah so like that's that's what i like about it next one i got from uh hot topic was the vegeta now i watched dragon ball z when i was a little bit younger and it was um, pretty cool. Um, I don't watch it now, but I still do like um, some of the characters from Dragon Ball, like Goku and Vegeta and uh, Gohan, Gotenks. They're pretty cool. Um, next, I'll do the ones I got from Amazon. So obviously everybody just loves Iron Man. I, I saw this one and I was just like, man, I gotta get this one. Like, it was from Endgame, you know, he has his little, like, Infinity Gauntlet, the Nano Gauntlet, and it just looks so cool. Everybody was talking about, like, you know, like, um, he should have had, like, battle scars or whatever because it's not, like, exactly from the moment of the movie, but I still find this pop so awesome, so... Glad I got this one in my collection. Next is Dwight holding Dwight bobblehead. I love The Office, one of my favorite shows, and just having this pop is so cool. The Dwight just holding him, like, you know, the bobblehead, that episode was hilarious. Um, you know, I wish I can get more of the, the Office Pops. I mean, I have about two, just two, because um, they have so many. But yeah, I really enjoy this pop. So I'm glad I got this one in my flex. Next, I'm going to do the ones I got from GameStop. Now, I went there, you know, I picked them up at GameStop because, you know, <clears throat> I didn't want to buy them online like the other ones. It was easier for me to just go to the GameStop. So I got the um, the Killer Stain from My Hero Academia. Um, like I said about the other ones, I don't really watch it, but I find him so cool. He has his like tongue sticking out, you know, got like the crouching position. And yeah, I, I just I thought this one was cool just to go with all the, the other ones. So that's that one. And then also got the Dark Phoenix that came with the Pop T set. Um, I thought this one was super dope. Like she's like pretty much just all Phoenixed out. Like, like she just looks so cool. So I grabbed that one. I also grabbed the Nick Fury, the 80th enemy. Marvel 80th years anniversary one now 
I definitely did not read the comics, so I did not know Nick Fury was, you know, white because I thought he was black from all the movies. Um, it's still a cool pop, you know. I love the design they have, especially on the back with the comic book that he first appears in. Nah, that's cool. Um, I have a couple of other anniversary, 80th, 80th anniversary ones, so this one will be doped to go with the other ones. And the last one I got from Hot Topic was, Hot Topic, GameStop, my bad, was the Borderlands 3 Butt Stallion. Now, I love Borderlands, one of my favorite games. Um, so, like, them making a pop, I remember, like, uh, all the jokes they had on Borderlands 2 about Bud Stallion with Handsome Jack. Super funny. Um, can't believe they made a pop on it. It's so dope. Like, one of like one of the best pops. Probably, like, one of my top five from New York Comic Con. So, this one, can, can't believe I got this one in my collection. Super awesome. Um, I'm going to do the one that I got from Barnes & Noble's. I only got one because I actually no, I got two, but um, I got one, another one from uh, friends friends of mine that you know that went to the con and got it for me. But the one I actually got from Hot Topic going there was the Masande from Game of Thrones. I actually do like this pop. I mean, she's kind of like just plain or whatever, but it's like you know Masande was such a great character in the um, the show. Um, up until her, you know, moments that, you know, the last moment she had. Uh, I'm not going to spoil it, but I'm sure everybody's watched it by now. But, um, such a good show. She was such a good character. And, um, I'm glad I have this one in my collection. So, um, next, I'm going to do the one I got from the, uh, Funko shop. Well, actually, I'll do the other one that I got from the, uh, from Barnes & Noble's. Well, I got this one from a couple that went to the con and was actually really nice enough to get me the, sh the actual con sticker of the Donald Duck. I do like this pop a lot. Like, it's super cool that he has his little, like, uh, fireman's hat and his little, like, axe in his hand. Um, I wasn't fortunate enough to get any of the, the con pop, like, the con sticker ones from the Funko, um... Um, you know booth at the con uh, So thank thank them that they got this for me. They got me in two other ones And I'm gonna show you those in a second, but I'm glad I got this one. That one's really cool um, So the other I got from the con was The poly pigeon um, They got me these um, They got me the two other ones. Well the other one the black shirt one this one I actually do like. I actually really would love to have the third one, but maybe soon just to finish off the, the set. But this one was really cool as well to have. Um, and then the other one, the black shirt one, um, they are really cool. I like them because they got their little like mask on and everything. So I think these are super dope. Um, the other one I got from the Funko shop was the officer freddy honestly this one is definitely like top five one of my favorite pops it's so cool just the freddy as a new york police new york city police officer he has his little like coffee cup in his hand and and instead of you know like i don't know it's just super dope like you know he's just like cool and then like even the back like it has him on the street or whatever it's just it's just one of one of the best pops i think from nycc um and the last one I got was like a, it was like a mystery box of like somebody was putting all the New York Comic Con pops in a mystery and you probably can get one of the, uh, you know, top hits like the um, Pink Pat Batman and I think um, the Mickey and a Matterhorn. So I was just like, you know what? I mean, it's one of the New York Comic Con pops. They're mostly the, uh, the constant ones and I really kind of wanted to get that Pink Batman so then couldn't even get a chance to get it in the, um, the the actual con at the Funko booth, so the one I got was uh, the Doctor Doctor Frank Poole from 2001 Space Odyssey. Um, I actually wasn't like mad about getting this one because he kind of looks cool. 
I don't remember watching 2001 Space Odyssey. I, I don't know if it was a good movie or not, but I actually think the, the whole suit like he has on is pretty dope. So um, that was a, a terrible one to get from the con. So and it's still, you know, it's one of the con sticker ones, so it's fine. So those are all the ones that I got from the con. Oh, well, for New York, New York City Comic Con. Um, I'm actually glad I got the ones that I really, really wanted. And, um, you know, hopefully I can probably try to get any of the other ones eventually. So, I appreciate you guys watching this video. Uh, like, comment, subscribe, you know, show some love. And I'll eventually get back to you with another video.